Hello everyone. Today I'm going to share my first experience at Growing Phoenix. In this video, I'll give you a two week update and a five week update on how my peanut plants are doing. So let's jump into it. Last winter, I was fascinated to learn that peanuts actually grow from a peg that starts in the flower and goes back down in the ground to make the peanut pod. That got me excited and now I'm growing some of my own. Peanuts are a full season crop and their wines take four to five months under favorable conditions to produce peanut pods. My growing season is just over five months so I wanted to get a head start and started the peanuts indoors more than a month prior to the last frost date. We use raw peanuts in our household for cooking purposes and sometimes we roast them for snacking. Hence we had some handy to be used as seeds for planting purposes. I am using two and a half inch cups that are filled with good quality seed starting mix. Since my seeds are more than two years old, I drop two in each cup in case one does not germinate. 20 days later, the plants have grown two inches tall and looks like they are ready to be transplanted. As you can see, the roots are looking, they need more room. I fill the pots with organic potting mix that has good balance of nutrition for these hungry seedlings. I water them after transplanting and put them in a greenhouse. I try to place the pots so that they do not get direct sunlight for first three or four days. This gives them a chance to harden off prior to exposure to direct sunlight. 35 days from starting seeds in the cup and 10 days from transplanting, plants are now hardened off in greenhouse. They have not grown much in terms of their foliage and their height because temperatures outside are much colder than what they were inside the house. Though plants look very healthy and I expect these to take off when the weather warms up, I'll put them in raised beds. If you've enjoyed the video, please give me a thumbs up. If you subscribe, you will get consistent updates on how these peanut plants are doing throughout the season. Feel free to leave a comment if you ever try to grow peanuts of your own. Thank you for watching.